Bukun. Book. And balloon. They all make a pretty satisfying bang. But which is Britain's loudest bang? Now, obviously, the answer is fairly likely to involve the words caravan and petrol. But if we exclude explosions, not something we take lightly on Brainiac, we come up with an intriguing experiment. I give you the piano. So, what's it like in the bang stakes? Not bad, but I think we can do better. Piano, say hello to Crane. Rigged with a quick release mechanism to drop heavy things from very high onto concrete. Oh yes, we are. Now all we need is someone to handle the measuring side of things. John, how are you? Very well, Richard. So, very come well. on, how's this going to work? Well, this is Brainiac at its finest. We have a 100 foot drop yes. and a 250 kilogram piano. Brilliant. I'm hoping it will create a heck of a bang. So what sort of impact speed are we expecting when it hits the deck? Well, I'm glad you asked that, Richard. Ah. I did some very complicated maths using Newton's laws of motion, and I've come up with an impact speed of around 50 miles an hour. Brilliant. Well, look, if that isn't loud, I don't know what is, but just to make sure we extract every bit of noise from this experiment, um, there we go. That, in case you're wondering, is the loud pedal. Right. A piano is a hollow resonant box that amplifies the vibrating strings inside. So, on impact, we should hear a symphony of discordant notes, coupled with the pleasing sound of smashing furniture. John, you've got toys! Isn't it great? Look, I've got some high technology microphones here, yes. a little gizmo to measure the decimals, and over there, that's where I'm going to be doing my analysis. Fantastic, so we've got it all covered. Right, well, if everybody's ready, clear the area. Three. Good luck, everyone. Two. That piano, by the way, where did he come from? Church Hall, I think. Right. One. Wow! What a mess! I mean, look at I think, yeah, as I thought, it's slightly out of tune down this end. It was brilliant. The question is, how loud was it? John? That was 111 decibels, Richard. Sounded like a bit of a bottom C to me. The decibel scale, named after Alexander Graham Bell, takes in everything from extremely quiet to absolutely deafening. The piano sound level was actually comparable to a baby crying. Rather more satisfying to watch, though. So, the big question is, what could be louder than a piano falling from 100 feet to land on the concrete? How about a skip full of crockery? Keep watching and find out what happens when several hundred play settings hit the deck.